Hi, I'm Steve Fisher, and I'm here with my friends at Kraft Music, showing you the Roland V-Drums Lite HD3. Now make sure you check out the bundles at Kraft Music because they've got everything you need to get you going with your brand new HD3. You want to play drums, but you need to be quiet? The HD3 is the quietest drum set on the market. The most quiet even among all the electronic drum sets, it's the quietest drum set. Why is that? It has some unique features and I'll go over those in just a minute. First of which, the HD3 is a very unique and compact design. It's super lightweight, it's portable, you can take it anywhere, or you can store it anywhere. It's very easy. Not only that, but it's got all the V-Drum's sound quality and V-Drum's durability and reliability that you would expect from a V-Drum set. To begin with, we have a mesh head snare. It's the same mesh head that's on all the upper level V-Drum sets. The pads have a cloth type head on them. They feel great and they're nice and quiet too. So you have a great acoustic feel on all the drums. Moving up to the cymbals, we have our V cymbals. The great thing about those, they're very playable and you can also choke them as well. Got our hi-hat with a hi-hat control pedal. It plays wonderfully. Now, one of the main reasons why it plays so quietly is because we have our integrated pedal design. See, the bass drum pedal does not have a kick drum beater that's hitting something. So it's extremely quiet, but yet still has a great feel. You'll notice the stylish look of the stand. It not only looks good, but it has a great function in the fact all the components are very adjustable. So if you have a young student or a young person that needs to play, you can lower all the components, or someone my size, you can raise up all the components. So they're fully adjustable. Now the module itself has 20 drum kits. Sounds from all over the world, all different styles. You'll find something in there just for you. It also has a metronome for practicing. And also, as far as practicing goes, it has a mix input. So let's say you've got your iPod or you've got a CD player or some external audio source you want to plug in and play along with, you just plug that into the mix input and start jamming and having a blast. Put on your headphones, knock your socks off. The HD3 module features 20 drum kits and it can cover a variety of different styles for a lot of different music you want to play. Now, besides the audio output, it also has a mix input. And what that's good for is taking an, an external audio source like a CD player or an MP3 player, plug it in so you can play along with your music. Of course, there's the headphone output so you can put on your headphones and practice quietly. It also has a MIDI output as well so you can connect it to your computer. Well, the exciting thing about the HD3 is you can connect it to your computer, and you can do that by using a USB to MIDI interface like the Roland UM1. Once you do that, one of the things you can do is buy the DT1 Drum Tutor software. It's a program to help you learn how to play drums. Now, if you're a beginner and you don't know how to play, it'll teach you how to play. If you're really good and you want to get better, it'll do that too, because it's designed for all different skill levels of drummers. It's very challenging, and it's fun to do at the same time. Let's take a look at it. I've got it up here behind me. One of the things you can see is you can actually see the display of a drum set down there, and you can see some music notation. Now, we've got a lot of great songs built in, and easy songs to hard songs, and there's even snare drum exercises as well, so if you want to practice your rudiments, it'll help you with that too. Let's say, for example, you don't know how to play drums. You're looking at music notation, and just it doesn't make any sense to you. This is the beauty of the DT1, is you can go to another screen called Game Mode, it looks just like the popular video games that are out there with the falling chips. And when the chips actually hit these different instruments, you play them, whether it's the hi-hat, the snare drum, the bass drum, whatever. And it is like a game in the fact that it'll give you a score. It'll tell you how many excellent hits you made or good or okay or how many misses you had too. Let's try it out.
Now that's pretty easy to do. While that's playing though, I'm gonna jump to my notation screen and voila, I'm going to be playing the music notation. Now you'll notice in the notation screen, this is what's really fun, especially for the experienced drummers. You can see where there's blue circles. You can see where there's red X's. The blue circles mean it was the right instrument at the right time. The red X's, either it's a, not the right instrument to play or it's not in time. For example, the bass drum that's right there, that red X is there, I was just a little bit early. So it's excellent in developing your timing because it'll literally tell you if you're playing in time or not with all the different exercises. It's really, a fantastic program and it gets you better faster and you just have a lot of fun doing it. Now a couple other quick things to, to mention as I mentioned there's different songs that we have on board here that you can you select a different song and start playing it and what's also neat though too there's a play panel that's here because what you can do with some of these different songs I'm going to go to my play panel and I'll show you what I mean I have the ability to take this song that's going to play and I can take the drums out because there was drums in there and I was playing along with it I can take the drums out or I can just hear the drum part in case I want to learn the drum part. So I can have a variety of different things. I can even set A and B points in the music and have it loop if there's a difficult part of the music that I don't quite understand and just have it loop over and over again. Take a listen. Take out the drums. or have the drums only. Speed it up. Get the idea. Another interesting screen that we have here is called the dynamic screen. If you're just practicing your snare drum uh, rudiments, that of course there's a lot of different snare drum rudiments in there to play, a lot of times you want to do is get an even stroke balance between your right hand and your left hand. And you can see in the display, it shows the dynamics, and even the dynamics of different instruments because they're, they're different colors. So for example, just my snare drum, So you can see both my right hand and left hand are fairly even. Now if I was playing, you can obviously see that my right hand is much heavier than my left hand. So there's a lot of helpful exercises in there that you can play along with. You can visually see how you're doing, scoring yourself, see if you're playing in time. The DT1 Drum Tutor software is just an excellent program to get you better faster. A great option for your HD3 is the PM03 monitor system. It's a 2.1 system with a separate subwoofer control. It's lightweight, portable, and looks great with a drum set. Now check out the bundles of Kraft Music because they include a PM03 with the HD3. Well, you've seen it and heard it, the V-Drums Lite HD3, the quietest drum set you can get, period. It's great for a variety of applications, whether you're recording or practicing, just having fun, even if you want to use it as a controller for your video games. You can do that too instead of the cheap little drum set controllers. Well, make sure you check out the bundles at Kraft Music because they include all the things that you need to get going with your brand new HD3. I'm Steve Fisher, and thanks for watching. <laughs>